Hey everybody, uh, we've got another unboxing video today. Uh, today it is the Kador Battle Group. So, let's open up, take a look. Uh, we got a couple things in this box. we got two heavy warjacks. One is the Juggernaut, and the other is the Destroyer. The Juggernaut is a axe and an open fist. Um, and the Destroyer is an axe and a bombard cannon. So we've got base for Sorsha. And she is in two pieces. Oh, wow. Maybe one more than that. Uh, looks like four pieces. Some of them are hiding. Okay, uh, there is Sorsha's main body here. Let's get focused on that. Okay, looks nice. Compared to the uh, original sculpt, I actually like this one better. Uh, they did a better job on her face with this one. The other one, she had kind of a pudgy face face, which looks a little strange on her very slim body. Okay, so there we go, and let's look at the rest of her stuff here. We've got her weapon here, her right arm, here's her left arm, making some sort of arcane signal, or making some sort of hand gesture. Okay, uh, and then the last piece I think is a shoulder pad or no, no, it's her, uh, it's her steam pack, her uh, field generator rather. Let's see, there we go. Not a whole lot to it. Tiny little thing goes in the middle of her back. Okay, up next we got a big bag of parts here. <clears throat> Tons of stuff. Okay, so. Two things we want to talk about with these guys. We've got nice big chunky plastic models here. We got two of those. One goes to each. They're both uh, essentially the same body, and they just have different arms. Um, in fact, that's exactly what it is. And because of that, we can uh, magnetize these so that whenever we get one of the normal boxes, um, we can uh, we can just swap arms out. So um, we got those. We got the shoulders that fit into the sockets on the sides of those torsos there. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, on the insides of these arm sockets, we've got these, these nice grooves that help us line up with any of the arms that have that corresponding groove in them. Um, this also helps us line up magnetizing. So if you put a magnet right into uh, that groove, you know that if you put it into the same groove over here, it's going to fit nicely. So. Um, there we go. Um, so there's the bombard cannon and the axe that goes with the destroyer. And then the juggernauts got the open fist. And the ice axe. So nice looking models. We do have a few little spots here where it was attached to whatever sprue these were initially cast on. But um, yeah, they lend themselves very nicely to uh, magnetizing. You can use um, some fairly large magnets, uh, eighth inch or even a little bit bigger than that will probably do just fine. Um, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, we'll take a look at the legs here too. There's the right leg, the left leg is almost an identical mirror of this. Um, and let's see here, what else we got? We got the, the two different heads. There's the destroyer head, um, which personally I never really liked. That, uh, that grill piece always looks a little too big for the rest of the head. Which makes him look like a kid who's crammed an orange peel into his mouth. It's pretending like it's his teeth. Uh, and there's the juggernaut head, which... I uh, much prefer over the destroyer head. Um, and let's see if I can find one of the hip assemblies. Oh, there they are. And it's got the sort of cod piece and the, the uh, I guess, butt flap, if you will. Um, <clears throat> and those are the two sockets that the, uh, the legs fit into there. And they're keyed, so you can't put them on the wrong way or anything. And there's the, the socket, or the uh, male piece that goes into the socket on the underside of the... Uh, the torso there. 
All right, well, I think that's all the pieces, and um, I'll do another video uh, sometime soon about magnetizing these uh, and just go over. I've got at least one of these jacks that are fully magnetized with all the parts for um, all four of the, the builds that you can do out of the plastic kit, which is the Juggernaut, Destroyer, Decimator, and Marauder. So uh, I'll post another video with that. It's coming up soon.